Hello everybody, it's Sailor Boy in the house again, as always. Check the site. Only sails. Sailor Boy! And it's uh, a little bit reefed, uh, Genoa. I mean the I I really want to reef my main but you know this one broke here loose but I can fix it I can use uh, another point here and uh, but you know to do that now is uh, not so fun uh, also why didn't I do it in port I'm so stupid uh, but I was stressed you know stressed all the time in a port people think that oh you can relax and you know no you can't that's uh, 25 dollars a day and you gotta do all the things you gotta do like uh, laundry buying things uh, fixing stuff cleaning all the boat refilling everything gas water uh, and my water jugs some of them have had water in them a long time so uh, you know you can't have it like that it's uh, could be bacteria and stuff so um, you know sale one number one so I'm uh, changing all that uh, yeah. so we're gonna do a tack soon and uh, then we're gonna have uh, I think it's gonna be a lot of better wind and I'm not sure I can see I'm passing one boat now uh, which already did the tack I mean, I I really want to gain as much height as I can here, so I don't have to tack again later on, or you know, be on the wrong side of the more uh, the boys. I want to be close to the green, not the red one, because there's a big uh, yeah, no, yeah, it's one guy is tacking now. He was too close to the red boys, so he's uh, going over. So I'm just gonna keep uh, going here. I can see there are uh, big ships here. Uh, also, people have been speaking of uh, drag dealers going here back and forth. You yeah, know that it's a pirate land here with uh, Dutch country. So you know, I having my eyes out for them too. Uh, yeah, and uh, that's all I'm gonna say about that. There's a lot of sailboats today, which uh, I, I feel so safe when I'm here. Uh, when I see other people, it makes me very safe. And uh, yeah, and it's so strange when you look at the map and think how it will. When you look at Navionics and you think at okay, you think islands everywhere. And I mean, there's no island. Well, it's an island there and an island there, but. Uh, there's like uh, half a meter water everywhere here so you think it's a big ocean but it's not it's just uh, shallow stuff and uh, yeah it's very strange how to uh, explain I don't know and uh, you have a big ship right big ship left what to do I don't know I'm just gonna go straight forward to uh, to land I think no I'm gonna go gonna go because we're gonna get as much height as possible. Uh, yeah. So I have a good feeling. When I get uh, when I get there to the lock, uh, I will uh, other side of the lock. I will uh, throw throw anchor, and it's gonna be a bad place for uh, wind. And it's quite shallow also. So I don't know how that's gonna go, but. The guys at the uh, marina I spoke to said that don't worry about it, that's the least of your problems, so I guess uh, I won't worry about that then. <laughs> and uh, yeah, we will see how it will be. And uh, now I have uh, a lot of boats on my right side, so uh, I feel a little bit sorry for all 
the big boats. They think the sailboats are idiots because now we are they are heading into me. That's a big dude. And also that's a sailing boat. I'm gonna hit him, so I'm gonna attack, but I'm gonna wait a little bit. And uh, as you can see here, I'm, I wanna go to the, um, yeah, a little bit more, like uh, one nautical mile more or something. And uh, he's really big, deep, that one. So I really hope he uh, won't hit me. Can do, are you gonna do? Is he gonna steer? I won't make it. Oh my god, this is making me nervous. Is he gonna? I mean, I'm a sailboat. I have to turn, bro. Go in my asshole. Or I'm gonna. I'm gonna go stern of that one, baby. He's not gonna turn. He's not gonna turn. I'm gonna turn. Turning. Turning. Because he's a fucking asshole. Well, to be fair, it's a big boat and uh, I shouldn't be turning. Yes. I mean, you don't want a guy like that go. Uh, Now I can steer up against the wind again. I will hit the faster. And that guy is tacking. Why is he tacking? The other guy. I can go more in the wind. Okay, now we're talking. We can go uh, one, two, three, four, five. Come on, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Oh, he, he, he was uh, tacking a little bit over. Now something happened here. The wind completely died. There's some uh, wind uh, shadow here. Could be pirates. I don't know. Now the boat is uh, totally crazy, turning and uh, stuff. And uh, we have a, uh, I don't know what country he's from. Uh, yeah, <laughs> funny thing. Uh, yeah, I think it's Dutch. I, I didn't know how the Dutch flag looked like really, so I thought every Dutch boat was French. So, yeah, kind of stupid. But then again, I'm Swedish. Swedish sailor boy, number one. Um, now we're gonna do attack here soon. I'm gonna go into the ass of the other boat over there. When I pass him, I will do attack. It's serious blowing here. I'm kind of sad I didn't have the time. And uh, the, I mean, if it would be good winds, I would stay here a bit and walk on the beaches and stuff. But you know, uh, there's no time. I gotta go south, man. It's getting colder and colder. Uh, the girls are gonna get more and more uh, clothing on them so you can't see anything. Okay. That's good enough for me.
not a nice hack. Uh, I don't like when to go upwind so high because I get really overpowered. Oh, you fell. <laughs> That's not good. I could have lost you there. <laughs> Didn't think about that. But it was not the light stack. And uh, yeah. And I got a this up here. But uh, we're not going as fast though, which is a bummer. But uh, we are whoop, before the tides now, so I think soon the tides will uh, switch. But. Uh, Yeah, I really don't want to go more to the left. I think. Or do I? Some points. I see the other guys are doing it, so if I can get to lots of speed, I'll have the camper. Yeah. Uh, four knots ish, three, five, four knots. Uh, that's not so good, but you know, uh, there's uh, nothing I can do. I'm uh, very close to the wind here, so maybe I should bear off a little bit two points there. Uh, yeah, yeah, I guess we got attack. That's a bummer. I thought I had good uh, good wind all the time, but it's always like this. Always. I get so frustrated. Could never be good wind. Whenever I'm going to go to South Big, it's shit and ass. Uh, I have never been uh, going uh, with the wind. Only two days ago when I went to the marina, I had the uh, wind in back for like 20 minutes when I went into the marina and I was like, Oh, so this is how it is. Uh, yeah, so boring. And I can see people are tacky way, way over there. So that's what I'm going to do also. Uh, it's tacky day. I can't, I can't talk because the wind is uh, blowing into me. But I'm not going to babble on now. Uh, yeah. I have boats everywhere. But I mean, by the boat. Sailor boy number one here. Uh, we are getting closer to our goal. We are uh, like uh, one hour, maybe one, one and a half from the lock. And uh, I'm just going through the lock then uh, anchor directly. So uh, my autopilot is uh, very strange and going everywhere. I don't know if it's the current because we have very strong current. I think it's like uh, four knots or something. Uh, it, that do, so it goes like this and everything. I don't know. But it's very annoying. And uh, I usually hand steer sometimes because we're doing this all the time. And there comes a gust and the boat is going left and then we're going right. And, but the wind is uh, cooled down a bit. Uh, it's not blowing uh, as much as it was before. And uh, I mean, that's good. But then again, we're going with the wind. Or we, we're not, we're going to broad, broad ridge, I think it's called, if the wind is from the side. And I can almost, uh, it's not hard wind at all. But we're doing uh, almost uh, seven and a half knots because of the current. So I'm uh, racing 
with a catch riggedy boat and then there's another guy but he has engine on so it doesn't count uh, yeah overall it's been a very good day uh, the day is not over yet so it could uh, everything can can happen you know uh, it shouldn't uh, surprise me if I uh, go on ground when I'm gonna anchor or the anchor is dragging loose and we're getting uh, really bad winds but if that happens I have wind is picking up and I can't be there I gotta go into a harbor uh, I'm gonna be to the eastern side I would love to be on the western side because it would be wind protection everywhere but I can't make it today uh, it would be an all-nighter and I would have the I would have the uh, why are we come on uh, I could I guess but you know I should take it easy and uh, sleep and uh, all that stuff it's not a uh, race but sure I want to get there but uh, we'll see about the winds and there's gonna be bad winds anyway and uh, I'm gonna go west I think of going back out the lock and going west up to uh, then uh, Halden and take that lock because then I can stop at places but I don't know uh, there seems to be a lot of weed everywhere they, they are talking about that I have to be care careful about and uh, they, they can come into the engine and everywhere and you get stuck and stuff so uh, I don't remember they, there was a site I could uh, use like water spray or something but I didn't write it down so we'll see I'm gonna search on it when I anchor if I can anchor, um, it's gonna be not so good anchorage. Now there's coming a ferry, so I wanna steer, so I don't. Uh, the, the boat is going everywhere, and uh, you know. But I mean, bada boom. So we're doing eight knots now. That's kind of nice, but then again, it's not my. It's the tide, so. I think the tides are like yeah, four knots, maybe four and a half even. So uh, yeah, there's a lot of boats here, uh, and the weather is kind of nice. There's a kind of dark about uh, now up there. That's the ferry. They're really fast coming up. There's the catch rig, which I'm, uh, I've been on him all uh, half, the ra uh, half, half the time. Uh, which is they want to go. They want to go. They want to go. It's called Tiger. That's <laughs> one fast car, let's say. Yeah, but. Uh, we'll see. We'll see. It's gonna be come on. There it is. Oh, it <laughs> I was almost going into ground here now. I should not do that. It was the waves which did it, I think. So I'm gonna let the wave wave action cool down a bit. Oh well, I'm gonna turn you on when I'm at the sluice and I can film it a little bit. Goodbye. And uh, the current and the wind at the nose. So, uh, you know, you can't sail. Uh, have to, uh, it's a very narrow uh, space here. Uh, a lot of boats going back and forth. Uh, so, I'm revving 2000 and uh, I'm doing two and a half knots. So it's not so fun, but you know, it's gonna, I'm gonna be there eight o'clock. It's a two and a half hour uh, gap, damn it. But uh, the lock is uh, 24 seven open, so I'm. Uh, it's okay. I'm not gonna. I mean, things uh, take time. I I can't stress. Uh, but
but uh, it's a little bit choppy, so uh, I'd love to do some food, but uh, I don't know. I should wait. And the uh, road is like this and pretty narrow, and many people, so I don't dare to go uh, underground or down below, as you would say. Uh, yeah. But I want to put a reef in, but uh, I mean it's no use doing that now because I won't be sailing uh, the really hard wind for today. Uh, but I will put it in tomorrow, uh, tonight maybe, or tomorrow, I don't know. Uh, I'm not really sure what to do tomorrow because the wind's going to be shit. And uh, yeah, I'm going to research uh, some uh, places inside Amsterdam. But I don't want to go for uh, engine all the time there. It's going to be, I mean, I can I won't do. So maybe I go west to uh, the other lock on the west side and uh, I'm going to have a wind for that th that day and I can go through the lock and maybe I could find somewhere to anchor there. Um, I don't know, I don't think so. I, I already checked and there was nothing. There's only a harbor, but I don't want to go into that. Yeah, I don't know what to do, but I really don't want to go into marinas. It's very expensive, and uh, my money is uh, going away. So I don't want that. I want to live as cheap as possible here. And now maybe I should uh, throw out some uh, line, fishing line. If there's even is fish here, I don't know. But uh, I will try anyway. Uh, <laughs> I don't think it's fish here. Could it be? No. I haven't seen any fishing boats. I will throw, throw it out anyway. I mean, what the worst that will happen. Um, yeah. So, you know, it's always that wind in that direction. It's uh, bugging me out. Um, everybody speaks about a place called Sex Haven. Uh, that sounds like a whorehouse to me, but it's. Uh, <laughs> they told me it's not like that. It's a good uh, uh, marina uh, and stuff. But uh, they did. No, I don't want to lay in a marina, so I'm gonna research that one. Maybe it's really good. So we will see. We will see. Uh, anyway, uh, that's it for today. I don't know what to eat when I get there. Maybe I will uh, get some uh, macaroni. I mean, uh, I have some eggs, as always. I could do uh, egg, but I don't have any bread left. I mean, I have bread, but I think it's too old now. I can't find an expiration date. But I will check early, and maybe I could take some uh, Egg, uh, but but I ate eggs in the morning, so I gotta have something else. Uh, I gotta do macaroni, macaroni, and uh, maybe I take some cheese and lay on it so it uh, get melted and stuff. I think that's nice. Macaroni cheese, that's nice. Um, and if I get the fish, I can uh, cook that one. And uh, you know, I haven't done that before, so it could be an adventure that, but. We got an anchor and that's going to be hellish. There's a big boat coming and uh, I don't want to get in on the nose. Oh well, see you later alligator, sail well.